Hello, everybody. This is Aaron Gaming, and today we're doing Are You? Because, I mean, are you kidding me? Why wouldn't we do Are You? So, we have Mr. Pring. Prinnell? No, Mr. Pringle. Yeesh, I can't spell. Okay, so Mr. Pringle is a jellicent. You jelly? You know you're jelly. You know you are jelly. Just, just admit. Just admit that you are jelly, so that we can move on with our lives, okay? And we have Handy Manny the Ambipom, who I need to make sure is female. And we have Goodnight, the Cherry Scarfed Glade, Close Combat, Circle Cut, Knock Off, Ice Punch, I forgot to show you his moves. Fake Out, Double Hit, Knock Off, Sandro, your turn. Um, I have Mr. Krabs with Earthquake, Roost, Stealth Rock, and Taunt. I have Whoosh the Moltres, which has Hurricane, Flamethrower, Roost, and Agility. And I have Rotom Meow. Thank you, Shady. I couldn't think of a name. Uh, Leaf Storm, Thunderbolt, Volt Switch, and Will O Wisp. And let's do this. I mean, I don't have anything better to do. Let's go. Uh, we're going to do three battles, hopefully, unless something horrible goes wrong. And let's do this. Just, just, you know, let's do this. Let's just get straight into the battles, you know? Um, sir? Sir. Sir. Did you take my team? I think this guy took my team. Pretty sure he took my team. Also, these Moltres spreads look nothing alike. Look at this! He has three of the same Pokemon. Bro, why did you take my team? I'm gonna lead off with the Krabs. He's actually a girl. He leads off with Tails. I'm just gonna set up my rocks. He runs the Ice Beam. What? But Mr. Krabs is just bulky as ever is like anything alive. So now I'm just gonna go for this. He goes for an ice beam because I'm a dummy and forget that I am uh, easily out dead. But now I'm just gonna go into good night. And see, here's my problem is he might not stay in. He might go out into that little spirit tomb. So I'm gonna go for a knockoff, because I mean I know I have speed if he wants to stay in. And I'm gonna knock something off. Might as well be. I feel like it's too early in the game to predict, but I also lost my Gligar because of the dumbass. Why am I such a dumbass? But anyway, so Good Knight is really, really, really. He's like a knight. He's like good. Good knight. I'm sorry, I'm horrible at explaining this. But anyway, so my team works out pretty well. I've used this one before. It's pretty much the same moveset, except Whoosh had more uh, speed investment than I put on it this time. Figured that since it has agility, it didn't really need it, and it could take hits better, so... If this guy could go, that'd be great, you know? Lamo woof 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 BBQ, sorry, barbecue. Lamo. Oh. L... L-A-M-O. It should be L-M-A-O. WTF BBQ. And I, what's inside the spirit tomb comes out and loses its black glasses. And I'm gonna go out into my little the Moltres really quickly because I feel like the the Willow Wisp is coming. But this guy can't make a decision apparently. Hey, he can't make a decision. I'm gonna go into whoosh. He goes for the sucker punch, which doesn't really matter. I'm gonna go for an agility now. Swiggity swiggity. He goes for the sucker punch. Tempted to go for another agility, but also I'm just gonna go straight for flamethrower at this point. He's gonna do 34% my speed in, or HP. Yep, buy what's inside. I don't care what's inside. What now? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. So he's gonna bring in the glider. The glider. And. I'm going to go for the hurricane, and seeing as how good I got, he eats it up, wow. He goes for the defog, and that means no more rocks. I do get another hurricane, and that is a dead thingy. I respect the defog, he does have a Moltres, I don't run defog on mine, and I do run a Moltres, so yeah, that can be a problem sometimes. But, I mean, I don't see Stealth Rocks in the or are you very much, so it doesn't really matter. Let's do this. Come on. Go, man. Go. Go. You have Handy Manny, although it's probably not named Handy Manny, because you're just not as creative as I am. 
Handy Manny, the woman, is amazing. Lamo, what the fuck, barbecue? Damn. This is weird. This guy doesn't have a good name. His name is stupid. Just like you. Wait, what? No, I said no. So, can I take a moment to talk about your lord and savior, Lord Gumi? Hey, he's back. Catch these hands! Catch these hands. Interesting. Well, I will catch them if I want to. Boom, eating it up. See, Foosh just likes eating things up. Now it's gonna go for a hurricane and outspeed. And kill this enemy palm with a crit hurricane, which didn't matter. So, back to our lord and savior, Lord Gumi. Lord Gumi is, well, He's a lord. He's a Gumi. What else do you need? You know what else you need? I think there's something else you need. There's definitely something else you need. Lord Helix. So while this guy's messing around and not doing what he's supposed to, let's do this. Can I take a moment of your time to talk about Lord Helix and Lord Gumi? Yeah, that's all. Lord Helix, Lord Gumi. Yeah. Your soul is mine. You are now under my control. Because Lord Gumi and Lord Helix. And now it's three. Three's gonna come in here. I'm gonna go for a hurricane. <laughs> 69% guys. Boom. Three. It's now confused. Punch yourself in the face. Three. Oh, he is a hurricane and by Hey, he forfeited, because he knew he couldn't win, because I'm just too cool. Anyway, so, back to our lord and saviors. Lord Helix and Lord Gumi. If these are not your lord saviors, well then I guess this is. This has to be, if, if Lord Helix and Lord Gumi are not your saviors. Must be Vivian. A.K.A. Six 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 Illuminati hail Satan. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, let's go to our second battle real quick. Cha cha, real smooth. Give me the loot. He wants the loot. I'm not going to give him the loot. You know. No loot for you. Nah, let's not lead off with that thing. I'm going to lead off Mr. Krabs. Mr. Eugene Krabs. She leads off the Cabalion, which I think I'm just going to taunt straight up. Straight up taunt. Hey, Mr. Krabs is a boy this time. What? He was a girl in the last battle. He's like, oh, he taunted me. I can't taunt him after you taunt me. Jerk. Oh, I'm just going to earthquake you now. You suck. Just kidding. I'm not going to go for another earthquake. You have a braviary. Oh no, Mr. Pringle's a girl. That's not good. I'm gonna go into Handy Manny. He brings in the Braviary. Or Airy, or whatever you want to call it. I'm gonna go for a knockoff. Straight for the knockoff. Oh, he goes into Kapalian. Uh, and he gets the attack boost. Yeah. I wish. I, I'm starting to really regret not running the Defog on this little thing. This little guy right here. He's gonna take a critical hit close combat, and now gonna go for an earthquake, because he's at 52%. He might wanna go for a taunt. I'm just gonna go for stealth rocks right here. He went into the braviary, as I got up my rocks. Not bad, me, not bad. I'm gonna stay in here, and just not go for the taunt, go for the boost. He sets up a sub, he's frightened by this. This behavior is scary. Uh, I'm gonna go into Mr. Pringle. He goes for bulk up. Okay, I'm just gonna start going for skulls. And I'm gonna, well, he does whatever he's gonna do. Uh, I need to make sure that Mr. Pringles is always a male. And Handy Manny's always a woman. Good night is always male because he has to be male. Mr. Krabs has to always be a male. Foosh doesn't have gender and neither does. Yeah. He's gonna go for more bulk ups. And I'm going to break his sub with a skull. No, I'm not. 
I literally need to break his sub very soon, yeah? Or else I might lose. And that would just suck. I'm going to start the timer. Because, well, he's just going for bulk ups. I mean, who? I'm going to go for Willow Wisp right now. Actually, why am I again going for Scalds when I run Ice Beam? What the heck? Okay, he just sets up another sub. I hate you. Person. I'm just going to go for Ice Beam now. Because I feel like I'm a stupid person. Yay, and Mr. Pringles, you're not very mystery. You're more of a woman right now. Okay, I'm going to go for a skull. He goes for the Brave Bird, and I'm very dead. I'm so dead right there. Oh god. So sorry, that was that was so dead. I don't even. Uh, I want to go into Handy Manny and go for a fake out. Clap right in your little face. Ooh, it's a crit! It's a crit! And at this point, heh, <laughs> OMG! Give me the loot twos like OMG, and bye! He deserved it. He was being a jerk and running a set that was going to crush me. And generally, when people are running sets that are gonna crush me, I don't like them. And. So yeah, and when, Smo when Showdown knows that I don't like something, they give me a crit. Oh my god! Ugh. Oh my god. Let's go. Let's do another battle. Okay, maybe my team members are all just extremely common. I'm really off with Mr. Krabs, though. He leads off with a Hitmonlee. As he is just gonna start setting up his normal gem sweep. So, I've gotten two DCs so far. Crits are a part of the game. And for you people who think, oh, crits are stupid and should never have it, you're stupid. Like, legitly, you're dumb. Crits are a part of the game. Just like bulk up. If you're gonna use bulk up, there's a chance you're gonna get critted. So yeah, if you're gonna rage quit because you got critted, I don't... Uh, you guys don't know this, but I'm raising my hands in the air. I don't know what you're going on about. You play Pokemon, and you know very well that there is a chance that you're going to get critted. Like, I got, I won that battle. That battle is mine. I'm, I'm going to go do one more, though, maybe. Actually, wait, I want to pump out two videos for you guys, so I might not. But then I feel bad about, you know, only doing one video. He's going to switch into a Tangrowth. Not bad, A.A. Ron. I'm going to get off a of burn. And now I'm actually going to go for an Ice Beam. Because, well, this is a Tangrowth. Well, yeah. You see, you see what I mean. He's going to get rid of my leftovers. He loves knockoff, apparently, just like Sandro. Sandro, this goes up to I'm going to go for a recover right here. He goes for the Giga Drain. I'm going to eat it up. Now I'm going to go for Ice Beam. No point in not just killing. Okay. Anyway, so, honestly, looking at his team... He has like one special attacker. And I disabled one of his late game sweepers in my opinion, which is a monkey. I personally think that, that is a really good late game sweeper. He brings in this Gilead, and I really do expect a knockoff right here. Go to good night. This guy loves knockoff. Like I swear. Oh, he goes for a psycho cut. I'm gonna cut you, you psycho. Wait. With the stab. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a knockoff, actually. <laughs> Slap him. Because I know I have speed, unless he's also scarfed, in which we're speed tied. Okay. Okay. Uh. He's assault vested. Oh, yeah, he's probably HP invested. Uh, I'm gonna go into Handy Manny. Feel stupid, because I just wasted my choice scarfer. I'm gonna go for a fake out. Who really wants to come in here and take a fake out right in the dome? The answer is Hitmonlee. Hey, in reality, if I were him and I didn't want my galley to die, I would very much be switching into that Hitmonlee to take a fake out. I don't know what he wants to do. That's what I would do. Let's see what this guy's gonna do. And while he does whatever he's gonna do, let's go talk about Lord Gumi some more. Because praise the Lord and save you. Now look at all these teams that I've built. Just look at it for a second. <laughs> this team is my favorite, though.
Look at this team. It's so beautiful. Don't you want this team? Cause I'm just fine with you guys using it. Like, really, this is... This team right here that you're seeing on the screen, I'm, I have no complaints about you guys using it. Okay, so he just decides to let his accolade die. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna go for a knockoff, because he's not gonna have speed. Bye! <laughs> anyway. So, if he brings in his Ambipom. He brings in his Ambipom. I think I can take a fake out, and then it's all up to the gods. Yeah, I can take a fake out. Now it's all up to the gods. Come on, gods. Handy Manny. This one's... The gods don't like creativity. Screw you, gods. Anyway, I'm gonna bring in this little guy. Mr. Krabs. Mr. Eugene Krabs. I like Mr. Eugene Krabs. He's, he's immune to other people being stupid. Just like me. Except I hate it when people are stupid. He brings in a Hitmonlee. Because so I'm gonna roost up to be full HP again. He can go for whatever he wants to. I'm gonna kill him. Ooh, kill him. See, he's gonna do like 10% to me. And if you look earlier, he does gonna hit his. He does gonna hit his stone edge. Guys, he does gonna hit his stone edge. <laughs> so he brings in his claw witzer, which I honestly kind of think is scarfed at this point. So I'm gonna stay in. I outspeed it. Never mind. It's definitely not scarfed. Uh, see, you can my Gligar outspeeded it. Outsped it. I'm gonna just go into the Rotom Meow, right? Meow. And then go for a Volt Switch. Because Rotom Meow is gonna outspeed this thing. If my uninvested Mr. Krabs Gligar could outspeed this little crabby thing, then. Okay, so he's actually gonna switch into Registeel as I get a Volt Switch off. Not bad, a eh, Ron. I'm gonna go into this little guy. Or actually, this is a big guy. I forgot. Uh, I'm gonna go start head start up setting it up an agility. He at times two speed as he starts cursing. I'm gonna blow some fire at him. Hope he does not run the stone edge. That would suck. Oh, I get a crit. He has iron head. That's not gonna do much. Going for flamethrower again. And in all honesty, two flamethrowers would have done exactly the same amount as this crit. Or a little bit more, but either way, I would have been able to kill. And I'd like to note how I am at times two speed right now. And he's going to bring in an ambibomb. I'm going to go for a safe flamethrower, because safe flamethrower is safe. He's going to go for fake out. There's no way for him to win. 46%. And his claw witch is at like 13, which means that when it comes back in, it's going to be at like 1%. And I can just outspeed it. And KO! Boom. Bye, Clawwitzer. Bye bye. And despite the fact that, you know, this has been a rather short episode with two DCs, you guys want a UU match, right? You know you want a UU match. Look at all this. You. You, you. Not OU, but you. You know you want to see this. So, since you guys want to see this, and I know that you guys want to see this, I don't know if you guys want to see this, but I know I want to see it, so you guys want to see it because I say you want to see it, and yeah. So if you like this one, you like this are you team building video, or not team building, this is just battling at this point, but if you like this battle, these battles, well then, don't hesitate to continue to watch, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to me, I'm awesome, don't forget that I'm awesome. See you guys later. Bye.